Hey gang, welcome back to Inverted Pursuits Laboratory, and this week we're actually going to discuss a pretty simple little topic, and it's just rocket stands. So, I actually have two different styles of rocket stands here. I have these two that are independent stands, and then I have this one interconnected stand. The interconnected stand here is usually the one I use while I'm in the workshop. It doesn't travel as easily because it's all connected. Uh, it can be taken apart because nothing's glued together on it, but it's just one interconnected unit moves simply together. It's 20 inches wide and allows me to set my rocket on there while I'm working and it guarantees it's very sturdy. Uh, the independent ones here uh, on the other hand are adjustable. I can make them any distance I want apart and they're very easily collapsible for travel. So the legs here uh, will spin and then they flat pack really nicely for taking with me to launches. So this is the set I usually take out to the launch site with me uh, for prepping a rocket on just because I find it easier to prep on something where I can quickly move the length especially when you start getting into larger rockets. This works better when you're working on individual segments or smaller level one rockets and this is much nicer when I got to larger rockets I was able to keep them spaced out where I needed them. I could suck them in really close together and hold only one segment on here like what we've been doing for Kelsey's level 2 rocket she's been building but these are just two different styles of rocket stands and now another thing you can do is you can see I have foam on this one. I've tried different types of foam. I've used uh, pipe insulation but I found that pool noodles work the best. The inside diameter is three quarters of an inch uh, standard three quarter inch PVC which is what I use for all of mine and I just never put it on this one because I use this one mostly in the workshop down here to build the rockets and it doesn't matter so much if I roll and scratch the rockets when they're down here in the workshop being built whereas usually when I'm out on the pad with these ones the rockets all painted up and I don't want to scuff the paint so got a little more protection there but that's just simply two different styles of rocket stands that you can build out of three quarter inch PVC that you can find at your local hardware store. It's a pretty easy thing to put together and a uh, handy little tool to have in your kit. Thanks for watching gang. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions on rocket stands, please let me know in the comments below and take a look at the description and check out my Facebook and uh, webpage that are linked down there. Thanks for watching gang.